Chapter 4 A Legendary Warrior Okay then, let's check in with Princess Sarah. It's the Bahamushan army! What? They're here already? Established a camp near our gates, then clearly they must intend to finish us once and for all. So what now? Seems to me we're going to have to nip this little problem in the butt. Hmm? What do you propose we do? We should take the fight to them. Uh, well said, but as things stand, Cornelia simply does not have the manpower. If you can just buy us some time, we'll do the rest. Huh? Me and Rain will sneak up on their boss and take him out. What? Mm. I, is it really that simple? Well, he may not exactly look it, but Lund's pretty good in a fight. Thing is, he used to get picked on for being such a pipsqueak. Please, as if you were ever any taller than me. Oh, well, I might have made up the pipsqueak part, but he definitely did get picked on. I think that maybe the other kids were a little creeped out by our arms. <sighs> <laughs> Still, we were always kind of proud that we look like this, because it meant we were just like our mom, right? I guess. So, let's talk more about Long getting picked on. Boy, did they make him cry. But, after I whipped him into shape, he never lost a fight again. Uh, wonderful. But that's not because he turned into some kind of bully-destroying machine. He just literally never picked a fight he couldn't win. Really? His threat assessment skills were uncanny. He always knew the odds. <laughs> Call it natural cowardice. Hey, watch it. So long. How about it? Do you think we can beat those guys? Piece of cake? Well, not a piece of cake. More like a very large sliver of cake. Well, there you have it. So, are you willing to trust us? Very well, then. We must act. It is only a matter of time before the Federation completely overruns Cornelia. We will fight and place our faith in the Mirage Keepers. Huh. What a weird thing to remember. I know someone bullied Lon, but why can't I remember who? the goblin camp up on that hill come on Goblin's boss senseless. Okay. You wish and boosh. Oh yeah. According to the Vanguard's reports, many of the enemy forces are capable of inflicting blindness. It impairs your eyesight and causes your weapon attacks to miss more frequently. Although, thankfully, magical attacks remain unaffected. Oh, why don't you take these eye drops? They'll clear up your vision in no time flat. Good luck out there. We're counting on you.
Good luck. I should have known that wasn't the last of them. Thank you. I owe you my life. I know this isn't much, but here, I want you to have this. Commander has taken position further up the plains. Be very careful. All injured soldiers have been ordered to fall back to this point and wait for further orders. Please, finish this fight for us. If I hadn't gotten injured, You didn't have to help me! I had those freaks right where I wanted them! Still, I cannot allow your valiant efforts to go unrewarded! Here! Keep up the good work, you two! I could have sworn I saw Princess Sarah on the front lines. Thanks for the help just now. You two are going up against the enemy commander, is that right? Take this, it'll come in handy. Show them what Cornelius' first brigade is capable of. We won't let Cornelia fall. Keep the pressure on this Federation scum. Princess? Dude, she is here! <laughs> I guess she's the hands-on type. <gasps> Your Highness! Behind you! Huh? Look out! Ah! Are you alright, Highness? Uh, yes. Thank you. Oh, schmuck! We gotta find a way down there now! We can go around! If we're fast enough, we... No! There's no time!
That move was awesome! I don't know what just happened. I think I do. That light would explain it. Good Captain. From this day on, you shall be called the Warrior of Light. <sighs> Me? Are you sure? Yes. The legends of Cornelia tell of others like you. Nameless heroes with great power in their hearts. Warriors of Light. You're a medium. One with the potential to become this realm's champion. Wait, a medium? A champion? Champions arise at critical points in time, where they awaken unexpectedly to their miraculous power. Candidates who hide this light within them, this strength, we call them mediums. The warriors of light, of course, are unique to Cornelian legend, but mediums for other champions can still be found throughout Grimoire to this day. Incredible. So I'm really one of them? Yes. There is no mistake. I think the light Lon and Rain sent me was a sort of reveille. Like I've been sleeping my whole life and finally woke up. Do you have that power? Do you have the ability to awaken mediums as champions? Oh. I wish we knew. Like I said, we don't remember all that much about who we are. Wait, hold on. Stand back, Princess Sarah. This guy must be their boss. Lon, it looks like the soldier's human. Don't get fucked. I don't pick on people weaker than me. <laughs> I just had to make sure. Let's go, Lon. Yeah. This thing is the massive. Seriously, what do they feed him anyway? Ah, uh, maybe we could stew over that some other time. What do you think? You got?
So bad. <sighs> See? Total piece of cake. Wait, this soldier's not human at all. Was he a mirage? What? No. The soldiers are human beings fun to become architects and join the Federation elite. What happened to him? How many years have passed? Time for us has resumed its march. Sigwaridus. Yes, what is it? You may begin. I trust you have worked out each detail? Oh, I can assure you. Every word. Then away with you. We have a prophecy to fulfill. Yes. Let us usher in a new age of history.